In today's video we'll be taking a brief look at ASRock's B650E PGITX motherboard. I'd like to thank QuiPC for sending it over. I'm not going to run through the entire spec sheet but we'll have this on screen while discussing some points of interest. I think one of the first things people would like to know is the M.2 fan loud and the answer is no. It can be controlled via the BIOS however it does take up one of three 4 pin fan headers on the motherboard. Two of the three fan headers are also 2 amp or 24 watt capable. One major downside of the board is the absence of BIOS flashback meaning there's no support for AMD's 3DV cache CPUs out of the box and will require manual BIOS update using a standard 7000 series CPU first. There is also no thermal sensor header on the motherboard. I have no complaints with the overall operation of the motherboard and didn't experience any VRM coil wind during testing. For testing I used the Ryzen 9 7900X and a Noctua NH-U12A on the BC1 Mini V2 open test bench. For testing, first up we have Cinebench R23 Multicore. I also tested the same setup on the Asus B650 AI motherboard and posted near identical scores. Now let's take a look at multicore clock speeds and CPU thermals. I did manually tune the 7900X to 142,000 PPT and set a negative 25 CPU curve optimizer offset in order to improve thermals. For those interested, the Asus B650 AI VRMs ran around 5 degrees C warmer in the same test. However, both boards are well within, re well within reasonable limits. Finally, to finish things off, we have CPU cooler compatibility. I'm disappointed that the Thermalright EXP90 coolers aren't compatible out of the box due to the motherboard's backplate design. I'm also going to leave Noctua's cooler compatibility sheet linked in the video description. Thank you all for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.